what is up YouTube, your mama Crank here, and this is going to be a tutorial on how to play Dolphin, use the Dolphin emulator, which is a GameCube and Wii emulator, to play online with it. Like, play, it's called, it's called Netplay, Netplay, that's what they call it, but yeah, this is going to be a tutorial on how to play with your friends over the internet without port forwarding or Hamachi. Okay, so first of all, I have a link in the description. You're going to want to download Dolphin 4.0-652. Once you do that, you install it, like I've done here. And then you're going to want to get a game. You can go to multiple sites called Cool Rom, or I'll put these in the description. Cool Rom, or you can download torrents for the games. And they come in ISO packages. And then what, after you get done downloading it, you're going to make a folder on your desktop or somewhere in your computer. So you have a folder card called Dolphin. And I put all my ROMs in a single folder. Now they'll come as ISOs, the Wii games to come at WBFS. Or well, sometimes they will come as um, .gcn, that's GameCube. Alright, so once you do that, you're going to click Refresh. Well, first you're going to click Browse, and you're going to tell Dolphin where you have all your ROMs. Then click Refresh. Then you have your list of your games. After you do that, you're going to have, you're going to want to have a you know, a decent graphic settings for your computer. So, you know, you have to try it, mess around some settings. I can tell you my personal settings, and that is right here 460 by 9, 1920 by 1080. Enhancements, internal resolution, auto window size, anti aliasing none, and this traffic one. Disable fog, only the one that's checked. On the hacks, skip EFB access, ignore format changes, EFB copies, texture, enable cache, and other. There you go. After you do that, you're going to want to go to conf config. And on GameCube, slot A, make sure that's memory card. On Wii, make sure you set insert SD card. After you, the, after you do that, you can right click on your game once it's in there and click host net play game. And then you have an ID right here. You click copy. Your friend, your friend gets that code and he clicks connect to net play and he types in that code and he clicks connect and he'll be right there without any port forwarding or anything. It's pretty, it's pretty cool. Now, you have to make sure that you, both you and your friend, have um, the same ROM. Otherwise, it's going to cause some complications. And GameCube games, they, they tend to lag a little bit more than Wii games during my research. So, I suggest you doing those. But, uh, yeah, that's really about it and if you have any questions or anything put it in like put it in the comments just section. one more thing at the end when you're when you have all your friends in the game going to go to configure pads and on when you're selecting the controllers they each have a set of names in each slot make sure it's their name and and colon zero so your name was um x name would be here Make sure it's at colon zero. And for the rest of the slots, you put none. And for memory cards, you put, you know, whatever person's memory card is going to be going off of colon zero. All right, that was the last thing. 